Hello everyone, welcome back to more Pokemon Sapphire. Yes, actually back in Sapphire this time around. We are back and this is what the team looked like after I beat, well, Wallace I guess, because I couldn't really do... Keep the team from uh, my battle against Juan. Anyway, my god. I just decided to take... First of all, um, I uh, don't like this at all, but my... Beautiful Salamence decided to also be eligible for museum purposes, so yeah, that's gonna make the master class even harder to deal with. So now I have to redo that fucking thing. Weirdly enough, like I had like eight of like those star things, but only like four or five like hearts. And the only reason I won was because of the stars. Because I was tied with like a hair across. And um, yeah, so what happened there is kind of beyond me. I was tied with hair across because of my, you know, my, uh, you know, the first round hearts. I won. But then I was eligible for museum. I didn't get that one. But yeah, also, after that, I decided to take on the league. And my goodness, Agron, what the fuck happened to you? <laughs> Because you've been getting fucked in that one. Anyway, now we're going to go get our final member of the team. Yes, people, we are now officially going for the final member of the team. However, that means that we need to take an entire route back. So most of this video will just be going back over here to Rustboro City. I don't know, I feel like this way might be faster. So I'm gonna take that way, and if I fight any trainers, I do apologize. It wasn't my oh my that was my Obviously I speed through most of this shit. But yeah, my Agron, I went up against Glacia. First of all, I forgot to give Agron like rock slide in that game, so that's fun. Anyway, so, um, my battle against Glacia was interesting. Every time my Agron missed Rock Tomb, every time my Agron missed Rock Tomb, it just. Gl the Glalie from Glacia decided to use Ice Beam and froze my Agron. I'm not even ca kidding here. I got frozen three times, and if that's not bad enough, her Wall Rain hit a sheer cold on my... Well, it took three tries, let's be honest here, but... Uh -oh, uh -oh. Must avoid all traitors at all costs. <laughs> I thought the Rick Kenyans right there. But yeah, that wall rain hit like sheer cold. It's like none of this happened in the first time. Man. None of that happened the first time I did this. Fine, I have a bike. Happy now? But yeah, none of that happened the first time I did it. So I don't know what the fuck happened there. But yeah, so that battle was uh, interesting. Everything else went kind of like as expected, expect except for the fact that my Salamence couldn't land a Fire Blast. Like, it landed two Fire Blasts on Skarmory, but both of them didn't even kill. I was like, hey, come again. I know your special attack isn't like the best of there, you know, it could be, but... This is still a bit of an embarrassment to both of us, isn't it, friend? We're back. Took us like five minutes or so to get back, but I did talk it a bit, so. Alrighty then, time to catch my final member of the team. Wait a minute, hold the phone here. I think I fucked up something. Uh oh. Crap, I forgot to remove dive. I forgot, I needed to go to Lilikov City to remove dive. And Lilikov City is so far away. You know what? 
I know what to do. I'll be right back. I'm back. Alright then, so... <laughs> I forgot to give that shit to him. I'm so stupid sometimes. Sometimes. I was about to give him what a... There you go. Fixed. Fixed it. I fixed it. Anyway, now I'm gonna go and catch my final member of the... I'm still stupid. At least this stupid decision is not the worst one out of them all. Because now I just need to go back to, uh... Burden of Town. Which this repel is definitely not gonna last. Time to go back to Vernon Turf Town because I forgot to buy nest balls. How many can I buy? Okay, I'll buy like 40 of them. I think 40 is enough. There we go. Well, the repel did last this time around. Anyway, also, if you're wondering why I came down here, um, at least this happened to me in the past. When I went to Bagon in the Pokedex, and I went from... Well, why did I go there? And I went from, like, Fall Arbor Town into the Meteor Falls that's, like, here. Bagon wasn't on the list of Pokemon that are available in the Meteor Falls, but when I came from Rust Row City, it was. So, this happened to me in the past. But yeah. Before we fight, but before we can catch Bagon, by the way, we have a couple of trainers we need to battle. And these are not really necessarily. I mean, some of them are skippable, but uh, I don't feel like skipping them anyway, so. Also, I forgot to say this during the playthrough, but um, when we met Steven Stone in Granite Cave way back when, um, he used an Agron in order to help out with a crisis. Also, when I met Steven Stone, like, uh, here, I guess, I had a 3v3, well, 3v1 battle with him. And he was shown to own a Metagross, who basically bodied my entire team. Blaziken didn't impress him, but outside of that, my team was basically taken out by his Metagross with the greatest of ease. And also, we learned that he had Skarmory. So those are the three Pokemon that we know. Why? Because he used Fly. He can't use Fly without a Flying type, and he has a Skarmory. So there you go. But now we are here. Okay, so the speed up feature is still here. Good. Well, bad, actually. So those are the three Pokemon that we know he has. Now, let's get through Meteor Falls and catch ourselves a Bagon. I just need a male one. At level 35. And in case you don't know how this works, we will speed up until we find it. Because this could take a bit. A little while. Alright. Let's take that dumb thing off of you immediately before we start this battle. We've all always battled Pokemon together as a twosome. We've con confidence in ourselves. Oh thank god they didn't talk about a threesome. A threesome would have been horrible. Now we'll make it a threesome. Blaziken and Absol stand by for battle. Why did I choose these two? Because they need to... Uh, let Hariyama make... Ah, you stupid Medichan. Yeah, I didn't think so. Come again. I had no idea this Hariyama even knew rocked him to begin with. Uh-oh. Wait a minute, this is bad. Absolute. That's even worse. Okay, what is happening? I have a dark type out here against two fighting types and none of them used fighting type moves. One of them even decided in their in its infinite 
No, you don't need to learn Slash. Which actually happened in the Wallace. I mean, Juan battle, but screw it. I was expecting a Detect or Protect or whatever the fuck to use. Doesn't matter, would have ended the same anyway. Good job, lads. Oh my, we've lost dear wife. That you have. This may not be the smartest thing to do, but it is a thing that I will indeed do. Blaze can front shot against the Dragon Trainer. This is where we, Dragon users, do our training. The champion even visits. Now, do you see how special it is here? By the way, before I battled Juan, uh, Steven Stone told me, like, you do know that you need a full team of six, right, when you challenge the league. And also that a good place to train was here. And also, what is revealed, I guess, later on is the fact that he actually knows the Bagon that we will catch. Oh, come on. Well, let's see what the other move does then. Let's see the damage for it at least, because I got nothing else. That's not really much better, to be honest. Still, basically, a three shot, four hits, actually. Unless you stake them. Come on. Yes. Okay, so. Oh, come on. What? It's still a four shot. Okay. No matter what, it's gonna be four hits. Well, I mean, Blaziken does need another level. Same with Absol, but. Let's not speak of that one. And also, I may just give fly to my Bagon just to, just so I can fucking fly. Because the moves that Bagon knows aren't all the moves that I need. Ah, good. Yeah, I can't believe that that happened in the league, by the way. Fucking three times frozen and the sheer cold. I didn't expect it to be so strong. Steven sent me here, actually. Now I need to heal up the team. Let's go over here. Well, I guess he was right. I'm I'm gonna put Apps up in the front slot because I feel like it's my best shot at catching a Bagon. Man, this feels so weird. Salamis was actually pretty good. Not perfect, but pretty good in the league. Outside of that, you know, Skarmory incident, which I will not talk about, but... Outside of that, everything else went perfectly fine. Also, I don't know when I'm gonna do the Master Rank. I'll probably do that with Shelgon instead of Salamis, like I did with Laron instead of Agron. Dragon Crawl. <laughs> now we come to Problem City. I have a total of... 42 repeat ball, uh, nest balls. Will it be enough to catch a level 35? Need Homo Sapphire on so that I remember the nature that I gave this idiot. It's lonely, I think it was. The ability is easy, it only has one ability. I also made a picture of every Pokemon and their stats when I challenge the league, because when I challenge the league, my Blaziken will be level 51 and everyone else will be 50. So here, where's my Salamence? There you are. Ah, no! Yep, lonely. Level 35 caught, lonely nature. I don't think that I'm male, of course. Let me just go over here, and we shall do this. Almost there. We'll be here for fucking ever. Mail, you fucking idiot! Thirty-five, you fucking idiot! Ah, close enough! Aha! We found you! Bite! Excuse me, the fuck did you just do?
You are my only hope. What the fuck did you kill it? Oh my god. Well, I guess now my only hope is Ludicolo. I mean, it's got like 105 special attack, but that's still like not as good. Wait, what the fuck is that special attack? But also it resists. Well, let's give this one a shot then. Let's see how this works out. That's why I found it. Because of the fact that the game knew I was going to kill it. Okay, let's do this again. Let's try this again, shall we? Let's pretend the other one didn't exist. Good. Finally. Had this energy drained. To be honest, when I catch you, I kind of want you to have a nature that is good. Alright, go nest ball. Get the fuck out of here. When I caught you in the actual game, I swear it took like 15 to 20 of these stupid nest balls because your catch rate is like, oh, you are pseudo legendary, so your catch rate is going to be abysmal. And I did even. And I lowered your health to red. It has a 45 catch rate. But I lowered your health to red and tossed like 15 nest balls before I even caught you. Oh shit, wait, hold for it. Yeah, speaking of phone. Let me grab mine. Please have the one from Sapphire in here, otherwise I am fucked. Uh, no, not brilliant. I was wrong with you. Please have the one from Sapphire. Here we go. Bingon, the Rockhead Pokemon. Bingon harbors a never-ending dream of one day soaring high among the clouds. As if trying to dispel its frustration over its inability to fly, this Pokemon slams its hard head against huge rocks and shatters them into pebbles. Yep. There you go. The thing is, is that this Bagon has been trying to learn to fly for a while because this is the training spot of the champion Steven Stone. Also, I like how his ability is Rocket and then its category is the Rocket Pokemon. Found that pretty funny. Alright, speaking of which... Speaking of funny moments, let's see here. Jolly, eh? Well, I have needed that uh, nature in my lifetime, however. By the way, I'll just say, yeah, it's special tech lower. Um, but however, I would like to say one thing. Um, what would have been better if they did that in the uh, anime? No, wait, in, in uh, like the remakes of Pokemon Ruby Sapphire. Ruby and Sapphire, you know, make Ruby now Sapphire, is if instead of having Wallace actually in the game, maybe they could have just had an optional battle with Wallace, that would have been nice. Being honest there, you know, headbutt, focus energy, ember, and dragon breath, I will delete focus energy for fly. I shall make your dream come true by fucking cheating, because I actually could not care less. Anyway, first I need to get out of here. And then the next time, I guess, we'll be training up this little one. Because um, the first part of this video was a total of five-ish minutes. And that means if I record for like another two or three, I will be having done that. Rudy Carlo, let's go. Let's get out of here. I don't know if I, when I, you know, like, use PKX, to, because, like I said, I have the actual, I forgot, I need to take a picture of, like, uh, his stats, because I'm gonna do the contest stats immediately. We're not gonna head for the contest yet, I will first make it a Shellgon, first of all. And I'm thinking about, because the thing is, Pokemon need more experience the higher level they are. So instead of just focusing on making my Bagon, like, you know, Instead of just like uh, dumping a bunch of rare candies to make a Bagon level 42, uh, I guess. What if I just trained up Bagon instead? Alright, I need to go to the PC. Let's go. Us bro city, here I come. But yeah, I shall give my Bagon the ability to fly because I really don't want to 
just travel throughout the whole look on my own free time I would easily do it but I don't think it makes for quality content and we have finally gotten our sixth and final member of the dragon variety I don't know why I do this I always go over there I need to go in here also what I actually found uh, out about my Pokemon Sapphire is the fact that I actually did get cast form in that game plus about some other Pokemon that don't matter I need this specific thing because I don't want my Bagon to evolve Everstone it is and then I need to dump some things in the PC because I saw some stuff like the ah, I could take this with me you need to go away um, never melt ice would be nice can you rock be nice oh shit I forgot to go back to the shoal cave no I don't know if I have time to go back to the Shoal Cave now. Fuck me. Oh man, I'm gonna go put you in the PC as well. Other shit here I will sell off. It took me one nest ball. I didn't even have to go to Verdant Turf to buy nest balls. But you know, if I didn't go back to Verdant Turf to buy nest balls, you know what would have happened, right? I didn't go back to Burning Drift Town to buy nest balls. You know that I needed more than two. Let me sell the Star Piece, Blue Shard. I don't need it. Sandstone can fuck off, and then the new get. Oh. Alright, and let's sell this is off too, making only half my money back. I don't really need to catch any more Pokemon in this game. I'll keep the luxury ball for good luck. Shall I? So yeah. I'll be right back. <laughs> 